Let's go on a little adventure. Smokey Dukums, and welcome to our adventure. I'm excited to do it. I'm excited to get it ready. I'm excited to get it started. It's already 4.30, so I'm gonna get the tent set up. Dude, I, I've gotten everything set up in this little thing way better. I've got my tent in there, I've got my poles in there, I got my hatchet, I got all the cooking necessities and stuff in there. We got steak, we got bacon, we got eggs, we got everything. I was gonna catch some fish. I even bought some more worms. I got more lures, everything. And whenever I was pulling off my kayak, yeah, it fell on top of the fishing rod and broke the fishing rod. So I just bought my wife a new Guggen Squad uh, fucking fishing rod. It's a, it's like lime green or green and black, her favorite color. So I had to get it for her. She, she loves fishing. I got me a new uh, cooker stove to a burner and I'm gonna be putting up my tarp this time there's some already paracord over here so I might even use that or just use these two trees maybe them two trees I don't know we'll see how it sets up whenever I get to that point I got the fire pit set up. I got the tent set up. I got a new a tarp and my uh, my poncho set up above this. It's gonna be doing some freezing rain and some sleeting tonight. It's gonna get down to 29, I think. Uh, but good news is I got me a sleeping pad. Let's go. And its R-rated value is 4.4. Uh, it's the Climate Static V. Uh, it's 4.4 R-rated, like I said. And yeah, I'm excited to use it tonight. I have a sleeping pad for finally. Then I have a 30 degree rated sleep, mummy sleeping bag. Uh, I'm excited to use as well tonight to see how actually it works. I got my heavy coat, everything. We're ready. We're ready for tonight. No, no problems. We're not going to have any problems tonight. I got my fire pit. Like I said, I'm going to do a little bit of sh digging. I got me a new little un unfoldable shovel here. We got some honey butter. Like I said, we got steak, we got eggs, bacon. We got all kinds of stuff to cook today. We got a spam. I brought it all. So we're gonna have a good old time. Enjoy the vibes, hang out in nature, explore our beautiful planet. You know my fucking motto. It's we're always gonna get out and explore our beautiful planet to see it for this once in a lifetime opportunity that we have to be on this earth to experience all these beautiful plants and animals and everything that's around. And we're also gonna leave it 1% better than what we left it with. So always remember that, that we're always, always gonna leave it 1% better anytime that you're out in nature. If you see trash or anything, pick it up, put it in your pocket. We're always trying to make things better for the habitat that's around. So then we can continue to explore our beautiful planet, have crazy adventures. Got this cannon rolled up, gonna get it all lit up now. We're gonna set the vibes right, get some firewood, get a fire going. So whatever's lit up with y'all, drop it down in the comments. Let me know what y'all are smoking on. Let's sit back and vibe out together. Cheers. First time moving in this thing, as you can see, it's real comfort. And all the reviews and the YouTube videos I've watched on it, it showed nothing but positive reviews. Mostly. Not, I mean, they said something about leakage, but I don't know. I'm not too worried about that part of it. Let's get it all unfolded. It said that I could blow it up by... Oh, look. I, oh, it's a screw on valve. Just pull it up. Now it says 
11 to 15 breaths I can get this thing pumped up in. Hey, I'm not going to. I'm just happy to be able to not sleep on the freaking ground. But this thing is gushing. And if you want to check out what I'm smoking on, the close-ups and stuff, it will be on my Instagram. This is a GMO cross. You can definitely smell the GMO. It's freaking reeking. But, yeah, and it's leaking. But anyways, let's get this thing pumped up. I'm going to set this down for a second. Hopefully, it don't go out. We'll just set you right there. So I can stand up. This thing on down in there. Nothing like some good smoke. Oh yeah. Look, we're gonna put this up right there. Just a little. Like I said, I always dig down my my fire and surround it with with the dirt and everything in these rocks because we want to prevent forest fires. Always remember that we're wanting to prevent the forest fires. Dig down and make sure you have a great good fire barrier. So whenever you do light the fire, it stays in one spot. Now, I gotta get the kindling. Oh, and I got a ferro rod. I'm gonna try to start my fire like that this time. Ferro rod. What do I believe? What makes me feel it? To write you this song. go i did it i did it i did it, I did it with the yes let's go i did it with the fair rod oh my god i did it Alright, so we got a good fire going. I'm going to wait till this continues to burn down like I was saying earlier. I'm going to eat this little Pal Crunch bar. But look, right here, we got steak. We got steak, I got bacon, we got sausages and cheese, salamis. Yeah, everything. We got some grits and butter. This is some Amish butter too that I got. Uh, I'm excited to see how that tastes and works and uses well. But right now, I want to eat this bar because I am freaking hungry and I need something on my stomach. How was y'all's New Year's? Was it good? I hope it was good. Mine was wonderful. I got to celebrate it with my wife and kids. I fell asleep at like 10 o'clock, 10.30. And I woke up to like at least like 700 gun rounds going off all up and down my road. Everybody out in the country was shooting guns and stuff. Bringing in the New Year's, you know what I'm saying? Animals went crazy too. So I woke up to that. Man. I just bought my wife the new Spyro game for uh, Nintendo Switch. So I might be bringing the Switch out here to do some gaming and camping sessions. If y'all would like to see them, let me know them in the comments. I love video games. Right now, I play Apex a lot. Apex, Fortnite, Halo. FPS. First-person shooters, battle royale games. I love them. 
I also got me a bag of black beans that go in here. With my rice as a non-perishable. So then I don't have to worry about that. Uh, if I'm ever out and stuck somewhere or anything like that, I'll always have them and be able to eat something. Let's pull out some coals. Brazilian Steakhouse seasoning. Got our steak. Excitement fills the air. Now. Cheers, my friend. Tonight, I'm just gonna vibe out, watch some YouTube videos like normal. Uh, see how my sleeping pad feels in my sleeping bag. I'm excited to use it. I ain't gonna lie. I'm so excited. Yeah, take some more B-O-N-G rips. More than likely. Let it keep cooking for a few more minutes. We'll put it down in there. I'm gonna dump. That in there. Oh boy, look at this. Cheers, y'all. Oh man. Oh my god. I hope that one day y'all can get out there and do it. And if I y'all can't, I hope that I can bring y'all the best experience through my eyes and the way I film and stuff. has been achieved i'm excited it's pretty comfy to sit on so i'm excited to sleep on it too i am gonna have to dump out my water in my bong after i smoke and stuff so it doesn't freeze and break or bust i just got this one because it's like on my last camping trip my other one broke because of me breaking it with the flame and it being too cold won't happen this time so it's nine o'clock I'm gonna be laying down here in a second. It's getting cold now. I don't know if you can see that. That's my breath. Uh, yeah, uh, it's I think 33 degrees now. So I'm gonna get one packed up right now. That GMO just comes through so much. Like I said, I'm gonna drop all my socials right here. You can check them out be greatly appreciated that's to keep up with me throughout my daily life and stuff as well and what are y'all doing this weekend y'all have any special plans are y'all going camping or hiking this weekend let me know down in the comments i always like to hear about y'all's adventures too nah, thank y'all for vibing with me thank y'all for hanging out in the morning we're gonna make some eggs bacon i'm just gonna lay here vibe watch some youtube Cheers.
I'm very comfortable. I'm gonna go back to sleep now and I'll see how that sunrise. Good morning. As you can hear, it's raining. But oh boy, do we have a beautiful view. It's good morning. I did have to get up this morning and uh, cut some sticks to put up against the tarp and stuff. No, no, no. I mean, it's still wet, but it's not rain coming down straight directly on my head when I get out. So we're gonna go and get a little bit, something rolled up, hang out for a little while. I got my little camp and cook stove here. I'm gonna use that today. I'm gonna cook some eggs and bacon. See, I can get out here, not really get wet. There is the parts that drip, but better than getting over all the rain on, you know what I'm saying? Look at this view though. This is what I get to see. Whatever, I step out. Here, let's just go. Right like so. Well, there went my water holder. Oh yeah, we got flame, and I also got hit by my freaking stick. Any luxury now, baby? Okay, we got our kitchen. Let's get some bacon cooking. Feel that heat coming all over too. And then I'm gonna cook the eggs in the bacon grease. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're getting bacon, baby. And the wind's picking up too. But that's okay. It's okay. We out here vibing. We hanging out. We having fun. Take some bong rips whenever I get in back in there. I know that. Well, there went that. There went my other one. Let's go if he's big enough. Bacon. Nice to have y'all out here enjoying this with me. I appreciate y'all being out here vibing, watching, hanging out. Take our bacon, drop that back on there. Turn off our propane. And you proceed to let your water stick fall on top of you. Let's see if we can stay warm and eat our food now. Cheers. Mm. Oh, this is so good. We're vibing. I'm pouring down rain, so I'm not gonna really do much except stay in here. Watch the rain happen. There. And it pouring down rain. Still pouring down rain. It's about 12 o'clock. The rain's supposed to be letting up around two or three, like I said earlier. And we get out and explore some. And do that a little bit. But for now. We're gonna take some rips. Nothing like a dab. Especially just sitting in a tent in the middle of the woods. Like, 
I'm about a mile into the woods. Cheers. It ain't no thing to do my thing, it's what I did the best. Yes. I caught that crib and bought two chains and then I hid the rest. And it's okay to do your thing, but just don't do the most. I put my friends in that old Benz and took that to the coast. It ain't no thing to do my thing, it's what I do the best. Yes. I feel my match. Look, I got on both sides. That's sick. Got a little hash hole rolled. But I did get to suck my fucking hand, as you can see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I got a bunch of this packed up in here already. Uh, now we're just gonna wait for this rain to stop again. I thought it was already stopping, but apparently it's not. I've really gotta use the bathroom. Oh, yeah. There we go. Well, it held up pretty good. Look at this on both sides. Now that is sick. That is a freaking cool little camp spot that we got right here. I'd say it was successful. Now we got the hash hole rolled and lit up. Time to go exploring. Look at these two creeks that were going beside me into the lake. Like, look at this. I got my Morel hiking boots on, so this time I can actually see if they actually work very good. Keep my feet dry. Well, I know I'm gonna be slipping and sliding. These things ain't the best. Best for that. Puff it on it slowly. Right after. Right after. And this was the campsite right here. This was nice. Other people set up camp in different spots around this area. Yeah, look at the little setup we got going. Pretty nice. Suited me very well last night. made it to the other side walking down this little bitty trail they have a trail right here that leads up to some other campsites that's over here so I could keep pulling the kayak down through here I believe uh, we're in a national forest so we can camp anywhere that's prohibited for free actually so that's pretty nice I'm gonna be exploring all these places a lot more campsites cleaning them up more everything like that i got trash bags back there so i'm gonna clean up where i'm at real good all the bottles or whatever but there we go we got the hole in there I definitely feel like I should drag my kayak up here or just come camping up here one day in general. Cause this is really beautiful as well. Pretty good flat area. There's not enough water been pulling here definitely. Big old fire pit, great fire pit. Look at this view that this place is. Oh yeah. Definitely 100% next time we're coming out here. We go fishing. Hey look, we even got a little grill spot right there. A little grill. There's a little cove that goes back in there. Uh, I'm not sure what goes on out in there. Let's go on and go back. Well, let's get this kayak out. Just to, just to go around that one corner that's over here. The, this one corner that's over here. I just want to explore right there in that one little spot. 
And we'll probably come back, pack everything up, wrap it up. Yep, put this out for now so we can get out on that kayak. That'll be fun. Definitely to be fun. Yeah, next time I'm coming up here and camping 100%. In the next three weeks, four weeks, about a month, yeah, we'll be back up here. This one area, I'll have a bunch of wood. We'll make sure it's a dry weekend. We'll have a good old time cooking some food, fishing, kayaking again, everything. This time we won't break the fishing rod. Yeah, let's stroll on back to that kayak. Yeah, I love this camping spot that I'm at. I've camped here twice before. Uh, the first time I made a bushcraft shelter. Right now, it's looking like a little cove back in here. My cherry just fell out and I turned it around and put it over here and relit the thing. We get everything packed up and head out of here. Peace, my friends. Spooky Doobubs out. If you enjoyed this video, maybe check out some of the other ones. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright Packed up, ready to head back. I gotta drag that thing back up the hill and everything. But yeah, it's time to get out of here. Beautiful, beautiful place. You'll see the water right through there but only through here and i'm a mile into the forest and i keep pulling this and I keep going through all this up and through all of that oh content baby i love it i love it the destination from point a to point b i love it i love it but this is what i go through be able to get to where I need to get to. More content on the way though. More adventures. You know what I'm saying? So definitely stay tuned. Check out my other videos. They're down below. Leg day is in full effect. I've taken off my backpack. I've taken it up there. I've already seen the car where I'm gonna be. Going. I made it up this whole hill. There's a really steep part of this. Yeah, I gotta make it up. All of this. Which probably doesn't look like a lot on the camera, but ooh, leg day is in full effect. We're almost made it back. And then it's time to plan out our next adventure. Oh. 
It's my first souvenir. Okay. Probably was a little deer, deer skull. As a look at it, but I got my first souvenir. Whew. Hey, there's the car. Uh, right there it is. Almost made it. Almost made it. Almost made think that I was gonna let this honey butter go to waste. Oh no, no, no. I beg to differ. After that long hard hike, we're getting some honey butter. 100%. Smear around that butter and that honey. And I know it's not hot, not toasted on the bread. But I, I couldn't let this go to waste. I couldn't let it go to waste. Oh, there we go. Mm. I am going to be warming that stuff over on the fire one day. Mm. Mm -mm. Perfect.